Welcome back to the bright side on 10 Tampa Bay. We are your hurricane headquarters and let's take a look. Well, it's the meat and potatoes, as I like to say, the hurricane season. It actually peaks September 10th, but what you need to know, see we're here. Well, it's already August 25th. Uh, we're right toward the peak of the hurricane season, and really we have 80% of the season to go through right now. Okay, so keep that in mind. Usually it starts quiet on the quieter side like we've seen, but then it ramps up in a hurry, and that's exactly what we're dealing with here. But we've got you covered, right? We're keeping you informed, prepared, and connected. Let's go to Central America, Honduras, Belize, Guatemala. I'm going to give you a little 3D scope here. Look at these thunderstorms. They're building near Cancun, okay, in western Cuba. This is the area we're watching this weekend, okay? A lot of this low pressure is very broad and disorganized right now, and it's going to be located over land, so that'll keep it from developing very quickly. It's going to be a gradual development, and then we'll We'll get the hurricane hunters that will fly in as well and that will give us some better data give us a better idea of how strong it'll be and exactly where it will go but the models are in good agreement that we should and will have a tropical system likely a tropical storm as we head into late weekend early next week you see the high ocean heat content that will tend to feed this system. So let's look at the winds, forecast winds. This is giving us an idea of where the system's heading. Okay, we're okay this weekend, right? Today and this weekend, but notice by Tuesday, 10 a.m., the winds will start to pick up here in Hillsborough, Pasco, Pinellas County. And then as this makes a move to the north, notice these are wind gusts. There you go. As we head into late uh, Tuesday into Wednesday morning, we've got some wind gusts of 30, 40, 50 miles per hour, and maybe even a little higher. We'll watch for the heavy rain and maybe some isolated severe weather. So just keep checking in with us. Uh, not only today, but throughout the weekend. And of course, we'll keep you and your family safe and prepared.